Hey, what's up? Thank you. the door for you. Good lightly brush. Yeah, hands. thank you. I'm Ben Kitsich. I'm Emilio Halperin, and we're in our design studio in bed Brooklyn. This building is interesting because half of the building is like industrial receiving um, and shipping, and the other half of the building is like furniture designers, uh, textile makers, metal workers. A good mix. A great mix. So when we went to look at the space, it was a gray granite concrete floor, you know, with like holes and stuff. There was a, like a broken AC in the corner. There was a busted radiator. But at the same time, you know, when you looked at it, you could tell like, oh, well, the architecture is really great. Like the windows, the natural light, the rent price. So it was like structures. a yeah. raw industrial space. But the Instagram profile of the space only had this wall. So you actually didn't see the windows at all. So we had no idea what we were getting into. And then I met the guy downstairs. We walk up and we open the door. And the first thing I see is this huge wall of windows overlooking the entire Manhattan skyline. He said we could go on the roof, uh, and then he opened the window and the window fell out. Yeah, the window <laughs> fell out. I think the radiator was like mangled to the ground. Yeah. So when we first moved into the space, the first thing we really wanted to do was to have a refresh and paint the floors and paint the walls one color so we could move into this white box. You know, we were really interested in making these radiator covers um, because we wanted to optimize sort of the amount of things we could put in here. So we did the radiator cover that could kind of act as a shelf. And then also because we work in here, but there's no sort of kitchen, we wanted to build a little kitchen out. It's probably what we spent the most amount of money on. I know. think they ended up costing, I would say like five, $600, not including the paint. But then I would say probably the least expensive thing we just like purchased and brought in would be the, um, we have these racks shelving, um, which is the shelving unit here. And basically it's like a more economical version of like Vitsu, where it's a semi-modular system. They're just uh, like extruded like metal uprights with these like brackets. Um, and then we just cut some MDF and painted it on the roof and stuck them up. Multiple people did say like, why are you doing that? Like it is a rental. Why are you building custom radiator covers for your rental unit? Like who, you know, a little bit of like who cares? It's like a work space. We were treating the space as a creative office, but also as a project in and of itself. We both primarily work in furniture and lighting, and then we also do interior design. Uh, but we both studied and started our careers in furniture. I mean, I also think as creative people, when you're in a space that feels good, you make better things. And so that's sort of my mantra of like, at my home, this office space, sort of the work that I make is like, if it looks good, I'll me or the end user or somebody, there'll be just sort of like an inherent and intrinsic feeling that comes from that.